stop scrolling. This is not charity. This is not politics as usual. And this is definitely not a small move. Elon Musk has just flipped the internet switch for an entire country. Air Starlink is now providing free internet in Venezuela until February 3rd. No bills. No contracts. No government middlemen. And the question everyone in America is asking is simple. Why would the world's richest tech billionaire do this right now? Skip this video. And you'll miss how technology just challenged global power. What exactly happened? Elon Musk's SpaceX-owned satellite network Starlink has officially activated free broadband internet access across Venezuela. This move comes during a period of severe political tension, communication blackouts and limited access to independent information inside the country. For Venezuelan citizens, this means instant access to global news, a social media restored, a messaging and video calls enabled, or a digital lifeline during instability. Musk confirmed the move publicly, stating it was done in support of the people of Venezuela. No marketing campaign. No press conference. Just action. A why Venezuela? Why now? Venezuela has faced years of internet shutdowns, a government-controlled media, a restricted online access, a communication blackouts during unrest. In moments like these control of the internet means control of the narrative. By activating Starlink for free Elon Musk bypassed state-run telecoms, air infrastructure limitations, a political bottlenecks. This wasn't just about connectivity, air it was about information freedom, and timing matters. This happened as global attention returned to Venezuela's political crisis, making Starlink not just a tech solution but a strategic one. Air how Starlink makes this possible. Traditional internet relies on cables, a towers, a local infrastructure. Starlink doesn't. Starlink uses low earth orbit satellites, meaning a no ground cables, a no local government control, a no centralized shutdown button. That's why Starlink has already been used in a Ukraine during war, a disaster zones, a remote regions, a internet blackouts. Venezuela is now the latest example. This is what makes Starlink different and controversial. A why this move is shocking the world. Let's be clear. A private individual just provided free internet access to millions of people across national borders. That has never happened at this scale. This raises serious questions. Should private companies control global connectivity? Or can governments block satellite internet? Or is Starlink becoming a geopolitical tool? Supporters say Elon Musk is empowering people. Critics warn no billionaire should have this much influence. Either way, this move has rewritten the rules. For the United States, this is a wake-up call. Technology is no longer neutral. Connectivity is power and influence now travels through satellites, not armies. Elon Musk has shown that tech leaders can act faster than governments. A infrastructure can bypass borders. A information freedom can be delivered from space. Whether you support him or not, is capable one of thing around is undeniable. The future of global Earth influence orbit. is digital. That's more than Elon twice Musk the weight. didn't just give Venezuela free internet. He sent a message. A message that information should not be controlled. A technology can protect people. Air and the future doesn't ask permission. This isn't the end of the story. It's the beginning of a new era, where satellites shape politics, freedom and power. If you want real updates like this, before mainstream media catches up, subscribe now, because this story is still unfolding.